All right, everybody. Welcome back to part five of Metal Gear Solid. Oh, my Metal Gear Solid Four walkthrough. <clears throat> Walk down these stairs. Last time we left off, he was upstairs somewhere. Oh my dumbass! I'm going the right way. Now there's a guy right there. Um. For this part, you're going to want to literally tranquilize everything you see for the simple fact that it is very easy to get caught during this part of the game because enemies are everywhere and sometimes they are very hard to spot. Like, that's not an enemy. That's, well, this is one. There's one, but I can't really reach them to him. Now I can get to him. Oh, crap. I did not notice them guys was right there. Okay, obviously I have a text message. That I'm not gonna answer because I'm having I'm having too much fun right now. Make up your mind. Are y'all gonna come over here or what? Hold on. Oh, oh, okay. Now for this part, you'll necessarily have to use the solid eye. I was using the solid eye because it's, it's kind of dark on the camera, and I want you guys to be able to see. But for this part. I do recommend the Silent Eye for the simple fact that, like I said, there are a lot of enemies that you cannot really see. You know, and they're, and they're hidden because their outfits match their environments. You know, so it's, it's hard. It's really, you know, you know, get this guy a ration if you want to. Well, fuck it, bitch. Collect the ammo and stuff if you want to. I'll climb up here. Do 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 do. to get a call. I gotta finish going. Uh, right here. Hold on. Yeah, I had a feeling this might be a short video. Huh. Sorry about that. Got to do the pause screen for like a good minute. Alright. These guys are your friends, so it doesn't really matter. Like, I'm gonna give them a ration. Oh. Okay, now. Like I said, they're. Two, three guys over here. They're right. They're right here. I know they are. Yep. 
was right. Three got four guys. Take them out accordingly. One, that guy's down. That guy's down. He's probably looking straight at me, but he didn't, you know. He hesitated, so. He didn't shoot anybody, so I just took a chance shot him. Alright, now, from this point on, it's going to be somewhat easy pickings. Take this guy all the way down here. Drop him. You can collect the ammo and stuff up here if you want. Oh, I was about to shoot you, nigga. Don't ever say no hey, motherfucker. Like you know me. Now, the reason why I'm taking these guys out... The reason why I'm taking these guys out early is because I'm going to have to deal with them later on. Rest in peace, MGO. Alright, you know, always want to take out any enemies you see early. Always take them out as early as possible so that way they won't be a problem to you when you're walking through or, you know, anything like that. I don't care because I already know what to do. Now, for this part, I'm going to take out the side of the eye so I can let it recharge. This part, now, now you can either go this way or this way. This way is a lot easier. Because you go, you walk around everybody. And um, since you walk around everybody, you only, you only, you only get to, you only deal with maybe about like four, maybe five enemies. Six at the most. You know, trank a lot. Oh, fuck. Fuck, fuck. Fuck. Didn't get him. He gonna be a problem. You know, take that guy out. Now there's two guy. Well, there's one guy right there. Take him out. There's two guys right here, and then there's a sneaky mf -er over there. Two of them. You know, you see this guy right here. Boom. Take him out. Take out his friend on the ground. Take out this guy. I don't even know if you if you even walk past the guy, but just take him out anyway. Now, like I said, it's a sneaky mf. -er. He's right there. Now he can see you for some reason through everything in the world. And then there's another sneaky guy over here too. So be careful. It's over here somewhere. I know he is. Oh, I just tranquilized him. He was that. The, he is the guy over here somewhere. All right, now you walk down here. Don't worry. Um, this part right here is very easy. You just walk through, walk through the outskirts and everything. was about to help but never mind but um walk through the outskirts all the way over here avoid any contact damn really okay I see I need the help cause y'all just can't kill this motherfucker right here Nah, I didn't get shot because I got seen. I got shot because he accidentally shot me. 
So, you know, that wasn't my fault. Also, you know, if you get lost, you just take a look at the map, you know, and it tell you where you're supposed to be going. But for right now, I'm going to try to stick to the shadows. Put normal on. Now, you can go in here in this little area. Um, the power plant, I guess, whatever you want to call it. Oh, power station. You can go in there and collect some items and stuff. But it's not nothing essential, you know. It's not like it's some camouflage or anything like that. It's just ammo and rations. You know, just little stuff. Alright. Moving on to the next part. Fuck the cutscene. Alright. All right, Drebin, I don't care. Oh, thanks a lot, man. Now, I believe I found... Oh, yep, I know exactly the way I found it, too. Now, me just doing a regular playthrough, because I, I love this game so much, I beat it probably by, like, 10, 15... 20 times because this game is just interesting every time I play it I find out something new that I didn't know before now there is a way that's over here it's either that way or this way but I'm just going to go through here okay it's not through here but there is a way that's over here and it's so much easier than going that way there's a lot less enemies and it's just more efficient so you, you make sure you just stick all the way to your left side you might run into an enemy or two you know tranquilize them you know see this way is much more efficient because it has way less more enemies Ooh. See, like before, I didn't have that. Now I do. That's why I say every time I play this game, I always I tend to find new things. Now here's the XM8, along with some other stuff. Woo! Right, go to sleep, bitch. I wonder if you could beat the whole game using the knife. I'm gonna try that one day. See, it's much more efficient going this way. Let you know, it's a lot less enemies and it's just you know, a, a lot less everything. You know, it's quieter and it's more stealthy. You know, so you can go this way, you know, during every, every difficulty. You see, because I haven't, you know, haven't been seen yet or anything like that. Boom. See that? Simple, easy. Now, the other way you could go was walking when the two guard. Oh, damn, I got to end the video. But the other way you could have went was walking towards the two guards that was coming towards you when that after the cutscene, after the start or whatever. So in this video.